Now to the boys state basketball tournament. Crete is chasing a perfect season and the Cardinals begin their state run this afternoon. 10 11's Chase Madison joins us live from Pinnacle Bank Arena. That's right, Kevin. The Crete Cardinals have a target on their back, some may say, but the Cardinals have weathered seemingly every storm thrown at them this season. The next foe, Platteview, is just 14 and 10 during the regular season, but you can't count out the Trojans. They were the Class B runner-up a season ago. To the highlights we go this afternoon. Crete was in control early in this one. We'll go seven seconds left in the first half. Ball finds Trace Edgy, top of the key, the deep three. He gets it off in time, the buzzer beater, and the Cardinals go into the locker room up by nine. Second half, Platteview hanging tough. Trojans get the steal, full court feed ahead to Jackson Adams. Adams, the two-handed throwdown, seven-point game. Cards stay poised. Edgy to Justice Gardner inside. He muscles it in for two. Crete builds a double-digit lead. Down the stretch, Edgy to Aiden McDowell. McDowell, the and one. He finishes with 11. Edgy with 13 points. And the perfect season stays alive with a 13-point win over Platteview. It's so relieving. Finally, just get to this point, you know. Just felt like a long season, but now it's here. You know, I think uh, this first one's always the hardest. You're getting patted on the back, and you have send-offs and, and all that stuff. And just to regain focus, get down here, and, and now it's a quick turnaround, and you're right back in the flow of more of a regular season. Here's a look at the current Class B bracket. Great game between Scott and Elkhorn earlier today. Crete will play Omaha Scott tomorrow. And currently, as we speak, Norris is playing Bennington. Norris has a one-point lead on the Badgers. We'll have full coverage tonight at 10. Of course, you can find extended highlights on 1011now.com. Reporting live from Pinnacle Bank Arena, Chase Madison, 1011 Sports. Thank you, Chase. The Class C1 bracket is wide open. There are some Huskers in the house as Ashland Greenwood chases a three-peat. Landon Mose drains the triple try. Hot start for the Blue Jays. They're up seven zip early. Cardinals kick it to Jacob Conlinson. Call this a DT3. We've got a close game at the Devaney Center. AG gets some separation in the second half. Dane Jacobson with three of his game high 24. Ashland Greenwood pulls away for the 48-35 win. Wahoo is making its 42nd appearance at the state tournament. The 20 and 5 Warriors meeting Ogallala. The Glock name synonymous with the state tournament. Marcus scores 14 today. Warriors are in control. Cody Hesser to Dylan Simons, and Simons says three ball. Now to the fourth quarter. Indians within six. Jace Kaminsky takes over. He scores back to back to back buckets. That spurt helps Wahoo snap a four game losing streak at the state tournament. Yeah, we felt great. It's best crowd we've had all year and it's just awesome to come and get a win at state. You know, every team's going to take their punches, but we got to be uh, man up a little bit and just respond back. Malcolm is at state for the first time since 2003. The Clippers draw top seeded Omaha Concordia. Mustangs are scorching hot early. Quinton McCafferty splashes the long ball. He's a Truman State signee. Clippers find some offense in the second. Carson Frank, hot dog. Frank scores 12 today. Malcolm down big in the second half. Maddox Meyer off glass for two, but it's not enough. Malcolm is balanced 72 to 36. Jim Weeks and the Auburn Bulldogs come to Lincoln with a 26 and 0 record. Maverick Binder, he's the Bulldogs top gun. Maverick scores a game high 20 points. Auburn races out to a double digit lead. Binder later finds Brenton Winsel in the corner. The Bulldogs hold off a late rally from DC West. Auburn is moving on while keeping its undefeated season intact. The top attraction in Class D1 is a D1 football player, Carter Nelson, Nebraska's number one ranked player. He signed with the Huskers, and he can hoop too. Watch this, a monstrous two-handed slam, and Nelson is not done. Later, a one-handed flush with authority. Nelson finishes with 16 points. Ainsworth will play in the semifinals Friday morning. Let's finish up with a buzzer beater. Guardian Angels, Angel Central Catholic and North Platte St. Pat's final seconds. Miles Dinslage over the defender and in. There's the horn. The Blue Jays knock out the number one seed in dramatic fashion.